Hi and welcome, my name is Dita and thank you for watching my channel. So yesterday was a really exciting day for me as I went to Rugby Bike Fest. Now this is actually in its third year of Bike Fest and it's been organised by Rugby Borough Council, um, uh, some motorbike groups and also it's in conjunction with St Andrew's Church. So yesterday while I was at Bike Fest I met a lovely lady called Sam Lee and she was really really kind to me and she gave me a little interview. She's actually part of a uh, Facebook group called Motorbike Women and they meet up quite uh, regularly and um, she was really really kind, gave me an interview and a little bit of an insight. So here is my little video on Bike Fest. I really hope that you enjoy it. I thoroughly enjoyed myself yesterday. It was such a shame that I couldn't actually be there for the whole day because I would have liked to have got a little bit more content, but it was just a really fantastic day and it was great to soak up all the atmosphere of the town. So I hope you like it and if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks, bye. Hi there, what's your name? Hi, I'm Samantha Lee and I'm from Rugby Bike Fest 2016. Okay. Um, I've walked 20 years, um, I took a bit of a break from the bike now, I'm currently riding the Triumph Street Triple, Street Triple R, my best bike I've ever had. Um, I admin for a couple of groups, one you can see here, Motorbike Women, which is on Facebook, which is a group solely for women riders, both in the UK and overseas. We put on quite a few events, get together, coffee meetings, tea and cake, as well as riding motorbikes. Uh, I also admin for a local group in rugby called Rugby Independent Bikers, um, who do a lot of charity work uh, for local charities in rugby. Um, I got into bikes really for uh, the family. Uh, the family are all off-road motocross champions. Uh, Mum and uncles all rode BSAs and Nortons in the 50s and 60s. Brothers rode bikes, so I suppose for me there was no choice but to get on and ride a bike. Um, my husband also rode a bike, um, and he's been riding a bike since he was 16. Um, so really I had no choice. Uh, rode Pillion for a while and had a baby girl about 22 years ago and decided that if I can have a baby, I can ride a bike. So I got on and I've never looked back. Okay, hold on. So, so why do you think Bike Fest is so important to rugby? I think having Rugby Bike Fest is absolutely fantastic for the town itself. It's now in its third year um, and it brings a lot into the town. It's a small market town and we, although we have Rugby School, which obviously is very famous and it's the home of rugby football, bringing more and more people into the town is actually great for the local economy, it's great for uh, tourism as well because it promotes the town. And also, you can see today there's lots of families out with their children. Bringing their children out to see these bikes in their hometown is fantastic. The children aren't afraid of bikes. Lots of family members can see that, you know, as bikers, we're really not a bad bunch of people. People do misunderstand us. But bikers are some of the most generous people you can find, and we do a lot for raising money for charities. In fact, Bike Fest itself is raising money for charities, and I believe that Blood Bite is one of the charities that they're raising money for. So it is, it is a great thing to bring this into the town, and as you can see, not all bikers are guys.